I'm a fourth generation pilot, which means I fly, my father flies, he has his license currently. Uh, my grandfather flew, and then way back in the day, before it was even like a common thing, uh, my great grandfather flew, and I believe he flew uh, for the French in World War I, actually. Uh, it was just an awesome thing that it's been passed down through those four generations. My dad got me into it when I was really young. It was kind of a, an incentive for getting good grades in school. He started flying when he was in college, but couldn't continue because of money reasons. And so when I got old enough to fly, he was really excited about me doing it. And so he kind of pushed me to start taking lessons and work my way up to getting my license. I usually fly uh, anywhere from four-seater airplanes to my size limit is like a six or eight person plane for maximum. So if I'm going anywhere, I'd prefer having a faster, a little more efficient plane. Usually when I go flying, it, I take a few friends out to maybe like San Antonio or Houston and we'll just have dinner on the river walk just to get a break from studying. Or uh, we might go see a baseball game or something just out in the middle of some other random town. But I have taken my, like my mother on business trips or several friends who needed to be somewhere. The farthest has probably been Oklahoma City for that. For the most part, you have the freedom to go explore. There have been times I've just seen some amazing things while flying. You, you know, you can see the 360 degree rainbows from the air, and I've seen that plenty, which has been awesome. Just landing over lakes has always been fun for me, and then flying in the clouds is amazing too. Getting your pilot's license is definitely something I would recommend for everyone to at least look into it or try. It does teach you quite a few things about just, you have to be a meteorologist, you have to know how the engine works, so you have to study the mechanics of flight, you have to study the physics of flight and how the wind wraps around the airplane and produces lift. You have to study radios, you have to study just so many different things to be a pilot. But if I'm just flying around by myself, a four-seater airplane just to poke holes in the sky is amazing.